Hello dear friends, let me a fix. Okay. Hello dear friends. I I do this makeup video for the in the name of makeup video, but I want to do some blah 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 with you. Okay. So this way we will not we will not waste anybody's time. It's kind of a blah 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 and um, for some time we didn't do blah 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 so let's see if we are still in the mood of doing blah 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 so I'm on vacation a little bit lost actually when the house is so quiet, it is the most beautiful time. It is very relaxing, but uh, when you are alone by yourself, it is so easy that you get lost in this loneliness, in this quietness. We long for it when we walk. But when it is here, when the quietness comes in such a massive way, in such a massive way, then it's it is a little bit overwhelming to handle it. So I would uh, like to blah 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 on that. It's good to have holiday. We have vacation, but it is also very important to have a goal for your vacation, for your, for the time on your hand. If you're just uh, sitting there doing nothing, you end up regretting because doing nothing is not productive, is not relaxing and everything needs effort even including relaxing. If you want to relax you have to make an effort to make sure that you can relax. Let things happen without planning does not work in most of the cases. You will not relax by sitting there doing nothing. You will get relaxed by doing things you like, you want, you plan to and by doing things that has a purpose that have a purpose by doing things that have a purpose and uh, <clears throat> if there's no such a purpose you get lost right Just sitting there, don't know anything, don't do anything, is not relaxing. When you make sure you have a goal for it, for it, you can enjoy more. It is not a hard job to make such a goal. Your goal can be so solid, so concrete. 
and so down to earth so easy I want to relax I want to take good two hours sleep go for it if that is your goal so that after that you can you can be in good spirit and good health and good mood then you can do things right family things needs time and energy your own things needs time and energy everything anything needs energy to deal with right so this may be your goal to relax yourself to have a good rest go for it it's all correct and it's the best so you can do one of the best things maybe you have some other a little bit more complicated goals you want to learn something then search and get enough material to facilitate this learning I want to learn drawing then go to library get some book go online search image search online drawing less lesson search YouTube lessons there are so many things out there and then <clears throat> step by step do not rush do not rush into result result will not come immediately it takes time and energy uh -oh. it's to lose to lose it takes time and energy and uh, takes um, just takes practice to learn something new something different right so I'm happy I was doing the drawing of fish I got the book from library you have seen the books and uh, so the very first was very the very first the drawing was quite uh, not good not skilled and uh, as it goes it's still not good I'm sorry it's still not good but I can see the improvement at least I know things clear I know the shape of fish, of dolphin, of whale, of sharks. So you know the general shape of it by doing it a hundred times, right? You draw a circle, always draw a circle, draw an oval a hundred times and then you get to know it, right? So it's a small practice. And uh, I remember when I was taking class in Paris, I got supérieur des beaux arts, and it uh, you need just sit there and do nothing but to draw. There is not much trick on it. You need to practice it, and the drawings. It's a, it's a creative job and it's a fun to do, but still you need to put a lot of effort, put a lot of practice in, into it. And that is not always so easy. That is not always so easy. You just need to get over it. and. Uh, and practice it no pain no gain no practice no improvement so have to do your job 
and then you will see gradually you will see the result. Another thing I want to do during this summer is to fix my 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 business. I always do not have time to take care of to take care of those things. Now I'm on vacation. At least I have a, a couple of weeks by myself that I can take care and then we'll be traveling and what I'm talking about I do not even know uh -oh. so okay um, <clears throat> So everything takes time, energy, and effort, and practice, and uh, you need to put your heart and soul into it and do it. So my business is not running well. I have an Etsy shop, as you have already known, and, um, and the YouTube is becoming less and less uh, subscribers and less and less views. Uh, it is developing into such an age is because one thing I did not have time to take care of it and uh, and uh, I did not pay enough attention when even at a busy time so this is a good time that I can I can calm down and and think about it so I would like to share with you one thing is how to sell your art online, how to sell your design online. I search the word, search YouTube, uh, no, search online, Google, search online through many browsers. Exactly the same keyword, how to sell design online. And then there pop up many, many suggestions, many, a good advice and then I look it through there are different websites sell online Zazos and uh, coffee press and and uh, all these things and through watching it through reading it then I find one thing there are too many things in this world there are too much information there and uh, we are not short of information. We are not short of resources. What we are short of is the ability to concentrate. The ability to concentrate. This is what we are short of. We are short of the ability to concentrate and drill down one thing too deep. I do not think I need to open 10 different shops. I do not think I need to make a hundred uh, many other different websites and go to different source. I have already my source then I need to stick on to it. And uh, for you if you I am already having it, but it's almost dead. So I was thinking of, uh, of uh, <clears throat> we are at the same stage, we are starting it. Once you find a good site, it may be eBay, maybe Etsy, maybe whichever website, they are more or less all the same. I am happy with Etsy and I will still stick on to Etsy and put effort onto it and uh, and um, make blogs and and all these things use social media to 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 promote this so maybe we should put it into more detail for example you open an easy shop i open an easy shop 
and uh, up to now still Facebook is one of the most active social media and Pinterest I like Pinterest I like uh, uh, Facebook I did not use Instagram much I did not use Twitter much but maybe they are all connected right now so once you do something put it up in front and uh, we we have seen people goes to the arts artists goes to arts and craft affairs go to art and wine festival that's the best that's a very effective way to put yourself up in the front but uh, it takes a lot of time and a lot of uh, a lot of preparation it's just uh, not so feasible for all of us once but the philosophy behind it does not change. The philosophy behind it is to put yourself up front and let people see you. And right now the internet is becoming so powerful. So when you do something, put it up. Put open a Pinterest account and put it up and um, put it on Facebook, do a video and uh, and make these digital things all connected. I don't think I will consider going to a physical physical market or something. It, it is just uh, I'm too lazy for it and this world has already created a place for for the lazy people like myself, like you, maybe. <laughs> so, um, stick on to one thing. We have enough information. We have enough resource. We have too much more things. And one thing we can do, we can take control of ourselves. We can take control of all these fluffy, all around things is to have a determined mind and have a plan. This plan does not need to write a business plan so long. The plan is today I make a new account. In one week I will open up my... I will post three photos. And when you have... when you give yourself a goal um, Give yourself a goal and, uh, and a scope of things you need to do. You have to do it. You want to do it. You want to fulfill it. And those goals do not make it too, um, too far from reality. One thing you can do, you can post online. And what you cannot control is people watch it, people see it. That's not what we want. That is beyond what we can control. What we control is solidly, step by step, building up ourselves. Once we have done our effort in building up ourselves, people watch it or not people see it or not. It's not my business. It's their business. I am good. You do not watch me. You are missing out big time. And uh, I have done my share. Of course, there are some, some marketing tricks and there are people living on it, how to promote people. But uh, there is nothing more powerful than your own hard working than your own thoughts. There is nothing more powerful than your own self to promote yourself. There is only one person who is the best marketer of yourself. That he is yourself because you know you. Nobody else knows better than you. And the heart, deep down in your heart, only you know. 
So this is kind of a philosophical makeup and uh, all I want to tell you is uh, focused, focus your time, your attention and dedicate to do the things you can do slowly you can build up a lot of things. Check the check down the link you will see my Etsy shop. I will put some new things and uh, you don't need to buy it. It's uh, I make my effort to make things pretty, to make things, to make my website better, to make my Facebook better. This is what I should do, you watch it or not, it does not matter. And if you do not watch, you are missing a lot. Bye bye friend, bye bye friends. This is words of encouragement to you, but mostly to myself.